One of the coolest things I've done here at UC Davis, I got to be a resident at the horse barn. I won this year's cow milking competition. I took a sustainable development class. Getting an internship at the UC Davis Botanica Conservatory. I got to work with horses at the horse barn. <laughs> I love UC Davis, it was a great school to go to. Hi guys, um, so my name is Johnita. I'm a fifth year animal science major here at Davis. We have 11 animal science facilities on our campus. We're gonna be seeing four today. So if you guys look to your left, um, we're passing the beef barn. This is our cow-calf operation. Um, so calves are born here and grow up here. Uh, this is the feedlot facility. We have the capability of feeding about a thousand head of cattle here at one time. They make the feed for the, the feedlot here, as well as um, some feeds for the dairy and the goat barn. It's bigger than what I thought it was. Yeah, yeah. a lot bigger. If you're interested in learning here, uh, I'm interested in teaching you everything that I can. So if you look at it, see how it breaks up, and so she's breaking that down. Look at the papillae in there. Uh, this is the UC Davis Dairy Teaching and Research Facility. We milk about 102 cows pretty much every day. And we milk twice a day, 4 a.m. and 4 p.m. Um, we also feed twice a day. Students run pretty much everything. My birthday is in October, and on my birthday, my freshman year, I learned how to hand milk a cow. So it was like the best day ever. Perfect. So I've been around cows ever since I was like three years old, and I've always been like fascinated by them. And then that's one of the reasons I chose UC Davis, because they had the facilities here. And this is the animal science department's teaching, research, and outreach facility for sheep. We have two lambing periods that coincide with our academic quarter. So I'm a student herdsman. Uh, what we do is we basically we live out here. We live over there in that barn. This is the lambing barn where three of us residents live. We work the sheep every day. It's a little messy, but this is my room. And then we do specific things like breeding and lambing. It's one thing to read it all in a book, but it's another thing to come out here, learn how to do it. I've always wanted to kind of work on a ranch and learn how that stuff runs, but I never imagined living in an actual barn. <laughs> this is the Animal Science Department's horse barn. Show me again and impress me. We are the original horse barn from the campus. So the barn was actually built in 1910. We're one of the oldest standing structures on campus right now. We go from collection to ultrasound, artificial insemination. We do the whole deal. We have some of the best toys in the industry. And my undergraduate students, UC Davis students, are learning how to use it. I ended up volunteering out here my freshman year and absolutely fell in love with it and found out that there's these internships. And so I took the classes necessary to do it and love it. Uh, we have as diversified an animal science program that exists in the Western United States. And we do have tremendous hands-on opportunities for our students. The coolest thing I've done at UC Davis is show a donkey at the Bishop Mule Day celebration. I got to be the breeding manager at the horse barn. I like how green it is. It's definitely a beautiful campus. Um, I like that there's everything from cows to the dairy, from birds to horses to swine to bees. Like, that's awesome. And there's quite literally every class you can imagine, so you're able to really find what you're good at. Lots of campus life, lots of student activities. The coolest thing at UC Davis is picnic day. It's easy to have a good time while getting a really quality education. A lot of people come into the school without, without the practical knowledge and coming out here you're going to learn it, you have to learn it. You could pursue agriculture in the best way by having a hands-on experience out in the field. Absolutely UC Davis, <laughs> hands down. <laughs> what could you do here? There's only one way to find out. <laughs>